Let's go to Rudy in Miami, Florida. Rudy, how can we help? Hey, how are you? It's an honor today. Thank you for the time. You bet. Thanks for um, calling. What's up? No, no problem. Okay, so to get to the meat and potatoes of it, so long story short, um, I started a business with my ex 12 years ago. Um, very unique business um, where we manufactured bicycles. Um, it was great for many, many, many years, but obviously like a typical story you hear, um, we broke up a few years back. Um, so, you know, for a few years, we've been trying to run the business, kind of like, you know, co, you know, you know, however you want to call it. But, um, but in the last couple of years, it's kind of been like uh, a head button, very, very, you know, dramatic type of, uh, you know, situation, you know, to the point where, you know, it influences employees and just, just a very toxic environment. Um, and I've been, you know, trying to lay down all the framework to potentially, you know, buy her out and, and see what we can do. But, you know, currently, you know, I'm in a situation where I don't have the funding that I can buy her out on. And she's actually the stronger partner of us too. So she actually, uh, you know, she, she took a little of the bearing of the, of the credit, you know, she took a little more debt than, than I did. So she's a little more reluctant to walk away and really leave anything on the table. Um, you know, loose ends. So Are you guys 50, 50. Kind of, yes. We're 50, 50. And that's, and that's not just a handshake. That's, that's written down and we've got some bylaws and we've got all that written out. Oh yeah. All written out. Okay. Um, you know, as interested as it can get, she's actually very, very, you know, I guess you could say old fashioned with that. So like everything yeah, is overly all right. tapered and all. So what's the, what's the heart of your question? The heart of my question is, so I want to continue the business. I actually started the, well, we started together technically 12 years ago, but she didn't really start coming in full time for like a year and a half later. So it really is my baby at heart, but I, I'm trying to figure out like, how do I get, like, I'm at the point where I'm, I've, I've invested hundreds of thousands of dollars into this. I'm at the point for my own health, sanity, you know, I study finance in schools, a random thing I got into that it's almost worth just signing over the paperwork and saying, have it all. Like, it's not worth my health and everything. I think Cause that's your you know, my new relationship, you know, my new relationship, it's amazing, but it's starting to, to affect it a little bit. I, you know, and, and it's just like, I don't know. I feel like the energy, and, if I sign it off. And yeah. Just put and it and Rudy, there. she doesn't want to sell the business, right? Like you guys don't want to just get out both she of you. Got, she always says she does, but she's kind of like, she comes from a lot of money. Will she buy she you out? Have, Will she buy you out? That's what I've been trying to do, and that's what I've been trying to get her to do. But she just keeps throwing it at me like, this is, you know, I'm, I'm not. I have no interest in this, so I'm not going to okay. get any further. Yep. All so right. you can't control her, Rudy. So for you and your sanity, I mean, you could chalk it up to what we call stupid tax around here. I'd walk. Do. I think you answered the question yourself. You just kind of laid it's gonna it out hurt. there. It's going to yeah. hurt, but it yeah. may be worth it in the long run, Rudy. I'm sorry. Yeah, I would follow your heart on this. And, this is why y'all don't go yeah. into business when you're not married. Mm. Man. Oh, boy. Rudy, sorry. Yep. You got to walk, man. This is The Ramsey Show.